An SUV driver dies after crashing into a gasoline tanker truck. It happened early this morning at a store in Colleen. The collision caused a big explosion that led to a fire. Tonight, many of the residents who were evacuated are returning home. News 10's Aaron Zeller has the latest. Gordon and Tara, one person is dead after he crashed his SUV into a truck full of fuel. And officials are still trying to clean up the scene. The tanker had about 8,900 gallons of fuel on it, and some of that is still coming out. Almost 9,000 gallons. That's how much fuel was in the tanker truck when an SUV crashed into it, causing a massive explosion. It happened just before 4.30 Friday morning, while the tanker was refilling gas tanks at Mickey's store in Killeen. The SUV, the tanker, and the store went up in flames. All you can see is a blaze of fire and smoke going all across the tree line, and people are just standing out there looking like, what's going on? Police confirmed that one person died in the explosion, so the driver like, oh, of the SUV. But yeah, the driver of the tanker truck escaped with no injuries. Colleen Fire Chief said that fuel leaked through the parking lot, spilling into a nearby creek, and a hazmat unit was called out to the scene. We're trying to get the fuel burn off and, and let it burn off without contaminating the environment any more than it has already. The fire caused power outages and road closures and forced neighbors to evacuate their homes. We had evacuated, got our essentials, got our families, and got to a safe haven. Residents stayed at the Colleen Community Center until firefighters could contain the blaze over seven hours later. The fire destroyed the store, telephone poles, cars, and even a Colleen fire engine. It was, it, was, it was a massive, massive, massive mess. The residents were allowed to return to their homes later in the day, and an autopsy was ordered on the driver who was killed. In studio, Aaron Zeller, KWTX News 10.